Okay, today, whew, glove test. Put this bad boy to the, to the test. Let's go. All right, I don't, I don't do uh, typically uh, glove reviews. There's so many gloves out there. Normally, I play either this Volvic glove, high-end leather, or the Titleist, top of the line, high-end leather. I mean, I typically use the best high-end leather glove out there. So, this company, uh, Caddy Daddy, reached out. They want me to test out their glove. I said, okay, all right. I'm not going to mess around. I'll give it an honest review and I'll let you know what I think, okay? So as always, thanks for watching. Hope you like uh, the video, hit that like button if you do. And if you wanna improve your game, learn about cool products and things like that, please subscribe to the channel. Hit the bell also so you don't miss anything. Let's dig into this thing. Here we go. Okay, right out of the gate. Feels like, um, let's say you're going to be a, uh, a doorman or door person. Uh, you're gonna work an elevator or um, uh, maybe serve somebody some uh, something, right? The, that's what it feels like, like that type of a glove. Except this part is rubbery, kind of like something maybe Spider-Man would wear on his, uh, on his hands, okay? That's, a, that's like a rubbery, very thin, almost feels like a wetsuit material. Okay, so this is a mesh, breathable mesh on the top, rubbery, Spider-Man, whatnot on the bottom. It feels different. I don't know if it's good or bad yet, it's totally different. But uh, all right, let's hit a shot. So, okay, we're ready to rock and roll. They say this thing will not tear, will not harden, will not now. I'm just gonna use it um, in this video. I'm gonna do everything today. So, but I'm really gonna try to put it through a lot of the, um, the elements as I can, okay? And, and see how it performs, okay? Um, one thing that is most people don't think about, I don't know if they think about it or not in a glove, is this, is the top. I like the breathableness of the top. That's fine, I like that. Here's the problem. I, my grip, what this is where we kind of they miss. I think a lot of people miss the boat. Is the top when I grip, I want to feel some um, some gripness on the top the to the top of my hand with my other hand. I want to feel it. Right now, it's a little slippery. So it, I don't know if it's good or bad. It's just I, you know the other gloves. I've got a little leather. I've got leather up here, and I I could lick it and stuff, and I get a. A nice, um, you know, connection in my hands. So, don't have that right here. We'll see what happens. Man, I hit a great drive. I don't know if that's any indication of this, but uh, I don't know. Here we go. Okay. Try to make it old quick. Here's one of the things that uh, you've got to consider is grabbing your wet towel, okay, and wiping your club off. A lot of us do it with the glove on, right? And uh, if you do it with this glove on, I will admit, the good, I got to be really careful to take this off because if this gets wet and dry, wet and dry, it's no good. So, what well, we're trying this wet towel, put it in here. Wet water, ice, all kinds of stuff. Wet towel, clean my club. Look at that, it's wet. You see it dripping off. I'm squeezing my towel, yeah. Clean my club. So I just did what, uh, I just did what I never would do. It's so slippery right now, you feel it. Slippery, all right. But now, um, whoops, it's dried off. It says it's an, uh, the palm will not crack, harden, or tear. Remarkable comfort. Lasts three to five times longer than, than leather. And um, conforms with the rules of golf. 
machine washable. Okay, that's all good. Um, also, it uh, says no animals were, were harmed in the making of this glove. That's good. Good, good to know. I, there might be animals harmed in the uh, testing of this glove, though. Anyways, no, no nothing's going to get harmed. Um, test, test, testing. Doing a test. Come on. Sometimes we've uh, we've just got to do some unconventional testing. Hey, if you're gonna make claims that it's not gonna tear hard or anything, I gotta put it to the test. It's pretty good. <laughs> the um, the top did tear in my cart testing. That was the top. They didn't say the top wouldn't tear, but it did say the bottom wouldn't. The bottom is holding up. I gotta say, the palm is doing quite well. The top, not so much, but not bad. I mean, I didn't drag it along the ground with the cart. So. Okay, the claw from Caddy Daddy, the glove. I mean, I gave it a pretty good work over here and uh, what do you think? Is this for you? Here's what I like, the pros. I do like the mesh outside. I like how it breathes in on my hand. I don't like the grip that I feel on the other side with my right hand against the mesh. So, I could live with it. It's just I'm not used to it, okay? I'm used to a leather on the other side. Also, uh, man, I got it wet, did a whole bunch of stuff with it, and it dried out very quickly. It didn't affect the grip and the tackiness of the palm. So I did, I did like that as well. It's got a lot of flexibility in it, so that's nice too. It's not too hard. I do like to lick my glove a lot and just kind of go like that. I uh, don't really want to do that with this one, okay? Doesn't, it's not the same as, a, let's say, a leather glove. Uh, all in all, it's not bad. It's, uh, I think it retails for $19.99, so it's on the higher end of the price range but uh, they say it will last a lot longer. So, other than that, um, the palm is in good shape. I mean, I did this a lot. I really try to tear it as hard as I could to make sure, you know, we're not getting any, anything any tears around the Velcro. So, that was nice. Who is this glove for? If you destroy a lot of gloves, you have one of those grips that just tears through your glove a lot, then this would be a good glove to have. Um, so, uh, that's, something to consider. I will leave a link, obviously, in the description below for these guys. If it's something you're interested in, I like it. I'm probably not going to switch to it just because I do prefer the soft leather and I do like to be able to control the moisture of the glove so I can have it uh, a little more tacky when I want it just by licking or spitting on it, things like that. Um, so I don't particularly like the feel of the rubber. Eye. It feels a little rubbery to me. So it's not what I prefer, but for somebody who destroys a lot of gloves, uh, I think it's a great, a great glove. So check it out, uh, Caddy Daddy Claw Glove.